Sorry for the wait there, gamers. I was busy playing Baldur's Gate 3. I'm such a gamer. Oh, the lie didn't work on my daughter. She didn't believe me for a second. Oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, no! Hold on. Hold on. Shh, shh, shh. Hush. Hush. Okay, it's okay! Can you believe this? Can you believe her right now? Can you believe this? I can't believe it. Can you believe it? Hush, 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 you're good. Hey gamers, it is Friday at 7 p.m. Eastern. And we got a special guest, it's a screaming, crying baby. We like to scram. Shh, it's okay. Would you, would you believe that she was sound asleep about five minutes ago? Would you believe that? Uh oh! Oh no! Oh no! Shh, 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 shh. Hold on, I have to soothe the baby. Shh, shh, shh. It's okay. It's okay, you little bambino. It's okay, you little spaghetti. Alright, so, it's Friday. We're supposed to be- we were scheduled to play Hitman, but, um... Well, we gotta discuss our scheduling and everything. Um, so, as you've ascertained, I am not alone today. I'm not alone today. I have a baby. Here she is. She's here. She's being a baby. And no one knows why. Um, so... She's just over a month old now. Um... When she was born... My job gave me one month paid parental leave. So for a month... I was at home. Not working. Here with the baby and getting paid for it. The month has passed and now I'm working again. Um, thankfully, I have a really good boss, so I'm doing a lot of telework. But on Fridays, I go into the office and today is Friday. There's a the thing about that. That means Cinco is home alone with the baby all day Friday. After also being alone with the baby all night between Thursday and Friday. So she gets very little to no sleep on Friday. So I can't really ask her to sit the baby while I while I sit here and play Super Mario Butt Kingdom for two hours while I stream. But here she is with me. So here's the thing, we have to consider going forward how we're going to handle this because Fridays have suddenly turned into a bad day for me to stream. A day that doesn't quite work out for streaming, so I'm wondering what we should do. The immediate thought would be to move the Friday stream to Thursday since I don't go into the office on Thursdays typically. So I'd be able to be at home, give Cinco a break, and then when it comes to stream time, I could probably have Cinco be with the baby while I stream. So that's my immediate thought. What do you guys think of the potential of me moving my Friday stream to Thursday? What are your thoughts on that? Give me your opinions. Why not? Because I don't know how you guys' schedules are. Like, I don't know if you guys don't have Thursdays available to watch me, you know? I might cross over with oh, this Julian stream on Thursdays. <sighs> See, I don't like to step on anyone's toes. <sighs> I guess we can just see how it would work out. Um... So that's what I'm considering right now. I'm considering the potential of Friday streams to Thursday, so... I might try that next week, because I really... I really cannot... leave Cinco with the baby all night, Saturday, uh, Thursday to Friday, and then all day Friday, and then expect her to continue to sit the baby for my stupid stream. Like, I can't do that. And there's not a lot of games I can play when I'm holding a baby with one hand.
Um, so I'm going to think about it. I'm going to think about it. I did not consider that I might overlap Julian's streams, and I don't want to do that, really. I'm going to think about it. We'll figure it out. I'll... Let's talk about it again on Tuesday. Let's see what we come up with. Let's do that. Let's, let's discuss that. So, let's play some video games. So I can't very well play Hitman when I only have one hand. So what if instead... We played something you can play with one hand. Like games that use a mouse controller. Oh, like Super Marino Paint. Gamers, I want you all to pick a letter of the word Mario Paint, which is one word, and I'm gonna click on it. First one I saw was T. Oh my god, get the fuck out of here, Mario. I'm gonna cover you in this shit. Yeah, that's right, you like being painted on, idiot! Idiot! He doesn't like it. That was T. Okay, next, I saw TM. TM does nothing. TM is a trick. I saw P. Wow. Oh my gosh, look at all this shit. Whoa. This is what it means to be alive. There's aliens. There's a car. Mario pisses on the train. Your plane is gonna fly away. My baby just farted. I'll click the O. Oh my God! Well, that's what happens when you click the O. Now I'm gonna click on Mario. He's doing it. He's doing the setups. He's gonna be buff. Good job. Alright, gamers, I'm taking requests. What do you want me to draw? What do you want me to draw? And anyone. Anyone at all. Draw Todd? I don't know if I can... See, I don't know if I remember what Todd looks like from from memory. I'm gonna try to draw Todd Howard from memory. I need a thicker pen than this. Okay, let's see. That, that's not... That's not right. No way. Go. He has his beautiful hair. It's not quite that color, but we can change it. I'm gonna change his beautiful hair to be correct, don't worry. Go. This. That's a little more toddly. Okay. Let's get this going. Okay. Some details on his face. Give him a nose. Light smirk. Go. There we go. He has an ear because he's Todd Howard. And that's what Todd does. He has an ear. Okay. And then he's wearing a shirt. I don't know if you know this, but Todd Howard wears a shirt and he has a neck. He has a neck and a shirt. Gamers, I had... Oh gosh. I don't even know where to start with this. Hold on. Let me finish Todd here first before I get into words. Here we go. Oh, this is so Todd. This is so Todd. It's unmistakable that this is the man himself. 
nobody would be confused by who this is. Nobody. This is art. This is beautiful art. There we go. Gamers, there he is. It's Todd Howard. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. Oh my. I think his eyes blue. Okay, let's see. Give him a little... Give him his baby blues here. There we go. Gorgeous. Wonderful. If any of you wants to hang this on your wall, you're welcome to, and I'll only sue you once. I'll only sue you once. Okay, now we have to destroy Todd Howard. Goodbye, Todd. Alright, gamers. I'm taking more- more suggestion. More suggestion. Give me more suggestions for art. Gex, okay. Let's see if I can remember what Gex looks like from memory. He's got these purple eyelids. Go. Some eyes. He does have eyes, I believe. We'll have to fix his eyes a little bit there. I think he's doing some kind of hog. I'm not sure. He may or may not be pogging. Oops. Let's see. Let's start doing some repair work on this guy. Go. Okay, we need to start getting these details and then make them into a real gexical. So let's see. He's got some yellow up here, and possibly. And then... Let's get some detail going here. So th this mouth shape is not very good. Like this, maybe? Retro Goon Ultra, thank you for subscribing. Go. He's like, he's like, licking out his tongue to say something. Oh, not, not there. Further down. There, he's a little giraffic. Slightly giraffic. Just a little giraffic. He only resembles a giraffe a little bit. K's Lion Paws, thank you for subscribing. Thank you. You did it. I don't know why you did it, but you did it. And that's good. Maybe. It might be good. It could be the worst decision you made in your whole life. I wouldn't know. I don't know what I don't know what other decisions you have to compare them to. This is the worst gex I've ever created. Really bad. <laughs> He's really bad. This is horrible. What kind of fucking gex is this? This is disgraceful. Doesn't even look like gex. Who who would ever look at this and think he's gex? Nobody. Not even an exclamation point. I have to make my own. Make my own exclamation point. There it is. There's your exclamation point. Wait, I can make this better. Hold on. There's your exclamation point. Damn, it looks nothing like Gex. It doesn't look like Gex at all. This is terrible. Kill him. We have to kill him. Fuck him. Get rid of him. Sh sh change the channel. Change the channel.
All right, gamers, I'm taking more more requests for my beautiful art stream. Draw Nathan Drake and his subway meal. Okay, let's see. Here. Here's, here's good old Nate right here. Yes. He oh, I'm coloring him in like this. I have paint buckets. Go. Now we're gonna create the Nate. Two, four, six, eight. This man will soon look like Nate. The man himself. Let's see, I don't, I don't know what his hair looks like. Is he like this? We have a pompadour. Nathan Drake has a pompadour, right? I think he does. He's, there's his trademark pomp. And now we draw the sandwich. It's wrapped in paper, as you do. You know, as you. <laughs> This looks like a giant blunt. <laughs> this looks like a giant blunt. <laughs> it just <laughs> Cinco! Cinco, go to bed! I'm holding the baby and doing this shit so that you can sleep. Go to bed. I could be playing Hitman. Stop it. <laughs> uh. No, sleep. You cannot watch my stream. The only reason I'm streaming this and holding the baby is so you can sleep. Go to sleep. I'm only doing this because I can do it with one hand, Zinko. I'd be playing Hitman otherwise. I was supposed to play Hitman today. Instead, I'm drawing Nathan Drake smoking a giant subway blunt. I wanted to play Hitman. This is, this is Nathan Drake belt. There we go. This... Are you going to go to sleep or not? Because I could have played the game I wanted to play if you weren't going to sleep. He's checkered pants now. Yes, the subway man himself. He's here. There he is. This sucks. This sucks. I was going to play Hitman. Instead, I took the baby, thinking I was doing a good thing for my wife. And what'd she do? She doesn't sleep. chat, but I promise you she's not going to sleep. Okay, let's see. Um, suggestions. Give me suggestions. Suggestions. Not suggestions. Recommendation.
Draw my wife sleeping. I guess I can try to do that. Okay, let's see. It's not gonna be easy. It's not gonna be easy. Blue? Probably blue. Probably blue. Here we go. Got it. Oh no. Please. 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 There we go. I think that's full in. Okay. And then. We got like. Bed frame. There we go. Go. It's, got, it's got some, got some legs. It's supposed to have some legs. Go. Oh, okay. I'm going to fill in. It's going to be a checkered blanket now. Oh god. Oh, okay. It bled a little. That's fine. It happens. Normal. It's healthy. Think she's sleeping, but she's actually holding holding the phone up here. She's holding the phone up here. She's still watching the stream. She's still watching the stream. She wants you to think she was sleeping. She was actually awake this whole time just watching the stream. I can't believe this. How could she? <laughs> she her head is over the bed. <laughs> Hold on, that, you're right. It, it, it's not supposed to be like this. Good. It's a good bed. Uh oh, gamers, my baby is scramming. Where's Toby? He's he's under the blanket. He's up. he's under the blanket. There we go. Okay. Now we destroy her. gamers suggestions and uh, recommendations I mean recommendations show me some recommendations in the chat not recommendations why am I stupid today requests drop Peter finding venom okay let's see here we go so let's see so here's here's good old good old Pete here he is Good old Peter Ruski. God damn it. This. There we go. Okay, okay. We're, we're making progress. Don't worry. Okay, so here he is. He's feeling very lazy today. He's feeling very lazy. He just is. 
He's feeling so lazy, so he's just gonna swing here. He's just gonna swing here. And, here's the thing. He's swinging here. He's not just swinging here. He's also... He's also holding... A, a delicious... A delicious pizza. Delicious pizza he's holding. I probably should have colored this in before I sliced it. Probably a bad idea. This was probably not the correct order of operations. There we go. Got some peps all over this pizza. Okay, he's holding the pizza and he's swinging. He's swinging. And then. And then here's Vendom. Here he is. Great. Wow, I did great. Wow, I did great. There he is. Okay. And he has a very big tongue. And he's going to use this tongue to lick the pizza. And he also has sharp teeth. And he has to be very careful when he licks things, because sometimes he accidentally bites his tongue. And that hurts very much. It hurts so much for him to do this. And these are his these are his 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 grabbing hands. And those are his grabbing hands for grabbing. And he's gonna eat all of Peter's pizza. <laughs> he's gonna eat all of the pizza, and Peter... Peter's like, oh no... <sighs> oh, but it's okay. Because Super Mario... ...is here, and he's gonna step on Venom. He did it. He did it, he stepped on Venom. Owned. Idiot. Owned. And then the Goomba is like, is like, what the hell are you doing? And, 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 then, and then Mario is like... Okay. Suggestion. Suggestion. Recommendate. Requests is the word. Requests. I am taking requests. All of these requests, I am considering them to draw. Sonic eating a chili dog. Homer having a cow. We're gonna draw Sonic eating a chili dog. Alright, here we go. Here we go. So he needs to have a big old mouth. Big ol' mouth to eat this chili dog with. This. There we go. This is his weird, like, elongated grape nose. Guy's weird mono eye, and he's very intently looking, looking forward to this chili dog. 
very intently. He's looking forward to this. triangle, a flesh triangle over here. He keeps his ears. Okay, and here comes the dog. Here comes the dog. Here it comes. It's almost here. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. The dog is on its way. The chillo dog. Let's see. Let's see. Oh my gosh. Here we go. We've got some mustard on his dog. Not really much of a chili dog, it's more just a regular hot dog. It's, it's got speed lines because it's, it's going up. I mean, it's going down. It's on its way. It's on its way in. It's on its way in. He's really going to enjoy it. He's really looking forward to this to this dog. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah, and baby Yoshi. Baby Yoshi is also on the chili dog. No, baby Yoshi, you're going to fucking die. This is so fucked up. I can't believe this. Oh my gosh. What a disaster. Alright, gamers, I'm taking requests. All sorts of requests are being taken today for the Mario Paint. Does anyone have a Mario Paint request that doesn't involve acts of terror? Draw your dad being nice. Okay. Okay, so... your dad. He wears a lumberjack shirt. Because he's a big manly dad. And he's so manly and dadly. There we go. Your very manly dad is here. He wears a big lumberjack shirt. Big lumberjack shirt because he's your dad and he's so big. And what he's doing is he is patting you on the head. Here, here is you. Here you are. This is you. This is what you look like. is you. See? He likes you. Now we have to give your dad his head. There. That is your dad being very nice to you. Your dad is so nice to you. What a nice dad.
I am taking requests. All sorts of requests. Bubsy the Bobcat hurling obscenities during a back-firing stand-up set at the Laugh Factory. I don't know if I'm allowed to draw this. not allowed. Okay, let's see. That's horrible. I need to show you this. I need to sh show you this. <laughs> the cat is trying to crawl up here with the baby on me, and it's not working. And the cat thinks there's room up here for him too, but there's not. He's very jealous that I'm holding the baby and not him. He's very jealous. Get out of here, cat. There's no room for you up here. Ridiculous. Back in here. Okay, so Oops, hold on, hold on. Getting ahead of myself. things. Horrible things he's gonna yell. He's very upset right now. Very- oh god. No, wait. <laughs> there we go. Some uh, bloodshot eyes. From how, how upset he is. He's like really mad. It's like furious right now. So mad. Here's his microphone. Holding the microphone. That's horrible. He's holding the microphone. He's really upset.
fill algorithms are complicated. I mean, not really, they're actually pretty simple, but to get them to work is annoying. Unless you have real programming happening. I tried to implement a fill algorithm in a... Click Team Fusion once, and it took me a long time to figure out how it would work without being able to do proper, you know, loops and stuff. But I got it working eventually, sort of. Okay, there he is. He's really upset. He's really fucking pissed off. I'm going on a tirade. Can't believe he did this. He's done. His career is over. What I think he's saying? Um... I think he's saying... I am taking requests. I am accepting requests. I am taking requests. Sorry, I'm picking my teeth. Do I accept recommendations? Sometimes. Draw bubble? I'm like, gosh. Can't be that hard, right? Like, it's just bubble. Number two. Where the stink line's at? Here we go. Some stink line's coming out of him. I saw a photo today of, like, green smoke coming out of some, like, German, like, government facility. There was, like, green smoke just pouring out of it, and my first thought was, wow, they finally, they finally picked the new Shrek! Adjust <sighs> myself here. Okay. Is. <laughs> Goodbye, Bubba. Oh, that one was disappointing. Gamers, I am taking requests. I am taking requests. Ow, my neck hurts from how I'm sitting with this baby. Pikachu, okay. Here we go, we're gonna have a good Pikachu here, let's see. There we go. Oh god, okay, hold on. We need, we need a better background. It's too bright. Black isn't gonna work, because Pikachu has black on him. Hold on. I wonder if this fill algorithm could have worked quicker somehow. Alright, here we go. Okay, here we go. I'm gonna make a big old pecan chew. Hold 
on, gamers. We have to get this just right. Just right. God. It's happening. It's happening. arms right there. There he is. Now let's, let's label him. So everyone knows that the, there's no numbers here. What? Oh boy. Uh, wait, these aren't numbers. Okay, so Pikachu is number Everyone knows that Pikachu is number 15 Pikachu. It's him. We did it. We did it. Okay. Now Pikachu should have a friend to help him get through the tough times. There we go. And now we're gonna need some music to go along with his journey here. see our beautiful work. Here we wait no, no it's not it. Now let's see our beautiful work. Wow. This is incredible. This is art. This is art. This is such beautiful art. No one can animate like this these days. So move over. Uh, move over, Habbo Hotel. This is the new hot YouTube animation in town right here. Oops. My Super Nintendo's menu came up. Okay. Okay. Oops. Red by Pikachu. Gamers, give me a request. Give me one. When am I using ZSNES? Have you ever tried? Have you genuinely ever tried to get the Super Nintendo mouse to work in literally any other emulator? I'm convinced that everyone who has made any emulator that's not ZSNES, like, 
it gets enjoyment out of like walking to the Wendy's drive-thru on their feet walking up to the speaker and trying to insert their penis into the speaker holes. I'm convinced that that's what they do for fun. And now I will draw Diddy Kong trying to steal Cranky's wallet for V-Bucks. Go. Exactly how I wanted it to. I promise. No, baby, shut up. I'm making D Diddy Kong steal wallet for V Bucks. Hush. Okay, here we go. Gamers, this baby just did a big fart. Thingies. He's fixing to nip that money. Okay, now we have Cranky Kong over here. Very hunchbacked. He has a big dollar bill coming out of his pocket to be stolen by a smaller monkey named Diddly Kong. Go. Diddly Kong stealing money out of Cramkey Kong's pocket so he can buy a Fortnite box. His TV got all wiggly. Analog horror. <laughs> Every time I turn on the TV and it defaults to static, I scream at top of lung. I go find my mommy and tell her that the TV is being uh, haunted. My mother tells me to get a job. I post on Twitter about her microaggression. My penis falls out. I don't know how to put it back in.
There he is. I kept asking for it. Here he is. He's the angry video game man. And his ref ref the reflection from his bald head is burning a hole into the children. It's happening. And also, he's- he's in Earthbound. He lives in Earthbound. No one knows why he lives in Earthbound, but he does. Did it. I can't wait to play Earthbound for the first time, Nefer. <laughs> oh, sorry, gamers. My neck is touching my ass. God, that hurts. Oh, okay. Hey, gamers, check this out. Turn this shit out. Check this out. It's Mario, and I don't know- I don't know who that other guy is. I don't know who he is. I don't know this man. I don't know this man. I don't know him. Now, you could play as the princess like a moron, or Yoshi like an idiot, or you could play as Super Duper Mario. Okay, there we go. One day Mario was walking, and then there was a bucket on his head, and he didn't know what to do. So he died of starvation. Push button. In this game, you beat the fuck out of Mario. And that's all you do. You just beat the shit out of Mario with a bucket on his head. There's nothing he can do about it. All he can do is scream and scream and scream. It's very sad. But you can also make blocks if you want. You can't beat the shit out of Luigi, because he's used to getting the shit beaten out of him. He's had it happen to him his whole life. His entire life. So you can't hurt Luigi. Can't be done. And then Luigi used his incredible skills of picking up a bucket to free Mario from his prison. And then Mario fell on the spikes and fucking died. Whoops. You know, I don't think this fairy actually feels sorry about what she did to Mario there. I think she purposely wanted Mario to fall into a spike and die. I think that's what she had planned all along. I think she's working with the other guy. Y'all don't know the shit. You ever heard of beating the shit out of this block to get all the coins? Moron. Owned. I killed Luigi. Kill him. It's the last thing I do. Wait a second, I'm not smart. Gamers help, the game thinks I'm smart. Ooh. Eat shit, Luigi! I feel like you should get a bonus for making Luigi cry in this game. I just feel like it should be a bonus. I don't know if it is, but it should be. Oh, right. All right, gamers, I'm ready. I don't know why these pies with the piece taken out of are here, but we will figure it out. 
I wish I could put the fairy into the spikes. Who we'll put this here? Cut that out. You're being a dick. Don't put things where they don't belong. I don't think you even know how to be a, a good fairy. Gamers, do you think anyone's ever drawn Luigi? Because I don't think they ever have. I don't think anyone's ever drawn Luigi. Eat coins, moron. Ooh. Remember that time that Nintendo had the year of Luigi and it cost the company like thousands, hundreds of thousands of dollars, and then I keep mentioning it forever for the rest of forever, forever, and we'll never stop hearing about it from me because I just think it's kind of funny. That was a good time. Okay, I'm trying to lean my head back in my chair because my neck is hurting, and I think the neck is hurting because of how I'm holding this babe, this babu, this babino, this bum bum bumperoni. Okay, we got this. Don't worry, gamers, we got this. I heard that they were going to have a year of Waluigi. But they heard from a fortune teller that if they have a year of Waluigi, then all their top executives will be arrested for... ...for crimes against humanity. I don't know how this happened. Did it. I'm the smartest man alive. Gamers, I lost five viewers in the time I stopped drawing in Mario Paint. Hit who? Get fuck! Get idioted! Get bent, moron! You stink! Get lost, you big drip! No one even likes you! Get destroyed, you d dumb bow! Nice plane for a clown to fly at the circus! Owned. I bet that's a Boeing. Haha! <laughs> See, it's funny because it's relevant, and I think someone got literally murdered by a corporation. So it's relevant and funny and dark and fucked up. <laughs> this is all Yoshi's fault. Gamers, this is the part of the stream where I, I ask what you think it smells like in that egg. I want you all to pretend I asked that and not make me actually ask it. Push button. Oh, oh god, uh oh. Oh no, they learned how to scroll. Oh my god. Oh no, this is a disaster. Oh, fuck you, I'm collecting coins. No, no! Oh god, I don't have control over the scroll! I don't have control over the scroll! This is bad! What am I gonna do? I want to collect these coins forever. That's all I want. Okay, okay, we got this. Get back here, Mario. You have to touch this star. 
got an entire up! I'll never die! Uh, Mathurb, when you said you bought pepper spray on Amazon, I misread it because I'm stupid and I read that you bought lemon pepper spray on Amazon. And I was like surprised that they made different flavors of pepper spray. And now I feel stupid and I also wish I had lemon pepper spray. Can I get, like, garlic salt spray? Okay, let's see. Stars. One star. Two star. How the fuck am I gonna make Mario go over there? What the hell? This isn't how Mario works. You expect Mario to jump? Mario can't jump. Mario can't jump? How is he gonna get that star? Uh-oh. Like, we just, like, shattered Mario's knees into 12 trillion pieces. I don't believe there's a way to get that star. Or maybe there is and I'm stupid. There's only one button and then two buttons and the second button just pauses the game. Why doesn't Luigi eat that eggshell whole at the end of the stage? Okay. Let's see. I don't think Yoshi's know how to swim. Background's kind of weird. Oh, I just murdered an innocent bird. Killed him. No reason other than I didn't like him. The only reason I had to do it. <laughs> oh, wait a second. What? Wait, what? Is this like a fake block? Oh, uh, okay, I guess. I'm still confused. What if Mario got to the end of the stage, and instead of Luigi, it was just Luigi's corpse? And then the screen had a VHS filter on it. And, uh, that's it. Subscribe to my Patreon for more in the horror games. Right, we want to get the star. I got it. I get the picture. Uh huh. Oops, no, 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 go back up there. Luigi, you wouldn't have any idea. What ethnicity am I? I'm, I'm a gamer. I have pure gamer blood running through my, my. The fingernails. Let's see. One, two, three. Wait, what's Luigi doing down here? Fuck. Luigi, get your ass up here. You're embarrassing yourself. Luigi, you're, you're embarrassing me in front of the boys. Was I supposed to send- I think we missed some stars by not sending Mario over that way. 
we definitely did. Yep, we missed a star. I'm a big stinky fucker and I smell. Why are the babies Yoshi's noses deflated? Because they smelled an egg. Ha ha. Ha ha. Ha ha. This is still funny, right? That's all I got. I don't know anything anymore. <laughs> I could disconnect it from reality. Oops, there goes gravity. I think this is still funnier than MatPat. Didn't MatPat die? I thought he did a video about how he was dying. What happened to that? Did he change his mind? Did he not die anymore? Is he gonna be okay? I hope he's gonna be okay. I mean, I say I hope he's gonna be okay. I don't really know anything about him. I don't think I've... I... No, I know for sure. I have never watched a single uh, video of game theory. I don't think I even know what he sounds like. I'm gonna, since I don't know what he sounds like, since I don't know what MatPat sounds like, I'm gonna assume he sounds like this. Hey everyone, welcome to Game Theory. Today I'm gonna tell you about how um, a glover is actually a foot. That's my assumption about what he sounds like. No, here's my assumption on what he smells like. Hey everyone, I'm Mad Pat. Today, I'm going to take a bath in this enormous can of anchovies. Oh! Am I correct? Is that what he smells like? I've never smelled them before, so it's basically a random guess. You know, I don't actually know what he smells like. Let's see. Coin, stars, Luigi. All many things a man can have. I think I was supposed to ride on top. Yep, missed another star, because I'm cool! Poor, poor Mario, his knees are gonna be pudding by the time he's, he's 39. He smells worse than Kojima gamers. I heard a rumor. I heard a rumor that, um... Kojima has been becoming a bit of a tubster lately. Is this true? Is this true? Has he been partaking in too much tempura? Is this reality? Hmm. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna jump over all these blocks to get to this star. Then we have to go home and drive Mario's car. Gamers, I heard that the reason that Kojima's eating so much lately is because Jeff Keighley broke up with him. It was really quite sad because... Well, how could Jeff do this? Like, how the fuck could Jeff do such a horrible thing? After all, they've meant to each other. Gamers, I heard that Jeff Keighley is allergic to high fructose corn syrup. And that's why he didn't want to do the, the Mountain Dew advertisement, because if he does it, he could die. Is this true? Is this, does anyone know? Like, they wanted him to chug a 2 liter of Mountain Dew on the Game Awards, but if he does it, he'll, he'll like, break out into hives and, s and start swelling up.
Namers, I heard that uh, Cliffy B invented Minecraft, and then Notch stole the idea from him. Does anyone know how we can avenge Cliffy B for Notch's uh, uh, intellectual property theft? Gamers, has anyone... What happened to Notch? Um, he decided that rather than, you know, enjoying being alive, that he'd rather, like, hold himself up in his candy room and be a miserable piece of shit for the rest of his life. So I'm sure he's, you know, enjoying that decision. I'm sure he's not regretting that at all. It's like, hmm. I, Notch, uh, uh, Johnson, that's his last name if you didn't know. I, Notch Johnson, now have a billion dollars. I will use this billion dollars to fund being the most disgusting man alive. And then he did it. How do you feel? How do you feel? It was a good use of money, yes? You could have instead bought one billion cheese roll-ups. But instead, you didn't. Instead, you were grody. How does it feel? Was it worth it? Are you happy? Do you think it's having a great time? Are you having a great time being miserable in your candy room? Gamers, do you think when I talk about Notch in his candy room and being miserable that I, I gain viewers or lose viewers? Because I'm not sure. I think it might be a negative. I think when people come here and they hear me talking about how Notch is a stinky dude to head, they, they might... They might leave because they want positive vibes. What should I discuss that will only produce positive vibes? What do you think? Because I can't think of, of any good positive vibe things to discuss. What games am I excited about? I don't understand the question. <gasps> Mario! <clears throat> Mario, I can't believe this. No, Mario, Mario, Mario! No, 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 no! Shit. Gamers, all you have to do to distract my attention from whatever I'm discussing on the stream is to just send a virus to five of my viewers to make them their their web browser close. Then I see the number drop by five, and then I get concerned that I have made poor choices of discussion topics. Gamers, I'm not gonna lie. I'm not gonna lie. I just did the most r rancid, disgusting fart. Okay, let me tell you. So, I went to work today. I went to work today, right? So... Senko was alone with the baby all day. But she didn't get much sleep, so she needed some help. So, Senko's mom... came over to help. And, you know, that's fine. Probably. I mean, it's not the worst. What, what do you work for? I work for the Being Miserable Factory. My job is to be miserable at the Being Miserable Factory. Um... So Senko's mom came over to help her. But Senko's mom is kind of... Something. So, um... She made... She said she was gonna make... Oh, I missed my star. She said she was gonna make... Broccoli cheddar soup. For dinner for, for, for Senko and me. And, you know, that's fine. That's great. I like broccoli cheddar soup. So, as I'm coming home... As I'm coming home, I get a text from Cinco telling me that Cinco's mom has made the soup. She made the soup, the cheddar broccoli soup, 
using Velveeta. That's great. That's not cheese. I know! You don't have to tell me that's not cheese. I know that's not cheese. So I ate it when I came home and... I mean, it was okay, but it wasn't really great. And, and now my, I'm making these really rancid farts and... Yeah. Yeah. Why didn't she just use cheese? Why did she use Velveeta? Why? What's Velveeta? It's fake. It's like fake, che sh fake cheese. I don't. I don't, I don't feel like describing it. Also, Cinco's mom has this bad habit of just bringing us fucking garbage that we don't want. Like, she brought over... Right, this first thing's not that bad. She brought over a tub of yarn, which is fine. Cinco crochets. But she already has, like, two big bags of yarn under her bed, so she doesn't really need another whole tub of yarn. Um, she also brought us, and this is also fine, she brought us some children's books for the baby. That's fine. That's fine, we can use that later. But then she also brought us some, like... Cooking or food magazines? Including one from, like, from, from Lidl, apparently, and it's like... Why, why did you bring this? Why would I... I don't want this. I, 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 I don't want, like, a book of things... From Lidl? I, I don't I don't want that. I don't want this garbage, so yeah. Oh, this is weird. Gamers Mario's about to run out of time. Everyone knows what happens when Mario runs out of time. He suffocates. But here's the thing. Here's the thing. If every time Cinco's mom is gonna come over. She's gonna bring a piece of garbage. Then, like, by the time a year passes, our place is gonna be nothing but the garbage. Can she just bring money? She doesn't have money. She just has garbage. So throw some of it away. I, what? I want to throw some of it away. I'm gonna throw all of it away. But what if she comes by? Like, another day. And doesn't see the garbage. Then what? Then what? Just say that Toby ate it. I don't think Toby can eat... ...magazines. I mean, maybe he can. I've never tried. One thing she brought us, and it seems fine, is she brought us this, um... This baby crib. That's like, a wood baby crib. And, and it can rock the baby back and forth, but the thing... And that seems fine! You know, that seems like a decent th thing to bring us, that's fine. But then, the baby crib is like... You now it's made of wood. It's a little pointy, and she brought us some cushions for the side of it, but the cushions don't really fit. They don't really fit, so they just kind of hang there and exist, and it's like, I don't want to put the baby in this? I already have like a plug-in- not plug-in plate, I already have a- I have a packing plate. We have two packing plates. We have two packing plates that have bassinets that the baby can sleep in and not rub against wood on. And, and they work perfectly fine. I don't need a big wooden crib that's, you know, 
a permanent piece of furniture. I don't need that here. How do I get to this spring? Fuck do I get to that spring? Okay, there's the spring I have to get to. How do I get there? Two ladders. How the fuck do I get to that? The hell? I have no idea how to get to the spring. At all. Like, at all. Because here's the thing. If you look at the... See, okay, this spring right here in the middle, behind the word push button, that's the button is up here so we can get to Luigi. But if we approach from the right, Mario will climb this ladder. We can't approach from the left because Mario will be walking up the ladder. We can't bounce up from under because there's no, there's, there's nothing under there. I mean, wait, there's this. But no, but then we can't make Mario go. If I hit Mario in mid-air, will he bounce? He doesn't seem to bounce. I feel like there's a mechanic in this game that I'm missing. Like, I feel like there's an important mechanic for this game that I don't understand. I think it's related to horizontal movement. Because how the fuck else... Here's the thing, the SNES mouse has two buttons. Left click makes me do that, right click makes me pause the game. Can I charge left click? No. Doesn't seem to do anything. the Little Caesars Pizza Puffs any good? So here's the thing. On the commercials, the Pizza Puffs look good. They look good. The problem is, when I sit here and think about, you know, a severely underpaid employee having to make those, those Pizza Puffs correctly and not burning them or destroying them somehow, I, I just realized what I have to do. It's at that point where I say to myself, the pizza puffs cannot be good. Something that tiny, there is no way that they're gonna cook it correctly without like... Without like... Denting them, or burning them. Or dropping them under... Under the stove. So in theory, I'm, it, it, they sound great. I'm sure if... A competent... Not a, I'm sure if a person who wants to make them correctly made them correctly, they would be good. But, at the same time, if I just get a regular pizza, there's a better chance that I'm gonna get something that was cooked correctly. So I don't wanna try the pizza puffs. Speaking of things... Th speaking of gross food, I had... I had a frozen breakfast burrito this morning I got from the grocery store. Why is it that every breakfast burrito, frozen breakfast burrito I've ever had has some kind of like nasty fucking gravy in it with the with the eggs and the, and the, and the bacon? It's like I don't want gravy in a breakfast burrito. I want eggs. I want bacon. I want cheddar cheese. 
and maybe some potatoes or something. I don't want gravy. Why would I want anything even resembling gravy in a breakfast burrito? Then make it myself? I mean, I, at this point, I think that's the only way to get a decent breakfast burrito. But I shouldn't have to. The point of frozen food is it's, it's there. It's ready for you. So why do they all fuck up their breakfast burritos on, like, on purpose? They're doing it on purpose to piss me off. I'm gonna fuck them up. Like, if I go right now to my kitchen, I grab a stale, expired tortilla from the pantry, and I fill it with scrambled eggs, bacon, and cheese, and I freeze it. And then tomorrow morning, I shove it in my microwave for, like, a minute. Will it come out with, like, gravy mysteriously added to it from, like, the aether? Will the- will- will the- will the grave- the gravy meister have added gravy to my breakfast burrito? Like, is this just, like, a weird, like, mythical beast who ruins everyone's breakfast burritos? The gravy's probably there to mask and keep it all together, but I don't- that's not necessary! It's a- it's a breakfast burrito! It's okay if it's a little messy, it's a burrito! If the pieces aren't totally together, that's fine! I just wanted to taste good! Why do they do this? I don't even want gravy in a regular burrito! Who gravies a burrito? Okay, we cross the spikes, we go up here. You notice that Koopa back there isn't wearing any pants? He's just wiping his ass on that cloud. Fucked up. Speaking of breakfast burritos, you know who has, a, who has a decent breakfast burrito? Burger King. Burger King's got a decent breakfast burrito. My problem is that the Burger King closest to me is like ran by morons who suck. So it's a miserable experience every time you go there. So I never go to Burger King specifically because the franchise near me sucks giga ass. And you'd think Burger King would, like, you know, maybe do something about protecting their image. And not letting any fucking schmuck just own and ruin a Burger King. But I guess they don't care. The Egnormous, that's right. The Egnormous burrito's pretty decent. Also, I like their, uh, French toast sticks. Taco Bell's breakfast burritos are decent too, but a lot- the sausage in them kind of sucks. And I don't know if this is still the case, but did they get rid of their, um... They got rid of their breakfast quesadilla at one point, and I don't know if they brought it back or not. I hope they did, because their, their breakfast quesadilla was the best breakfast item on the goddamn menu. It was better than the regular quesadilla, honestly. Also, I was thinking about it the other day when we saw a commercial for Subway. I have not seen a commercial for Subway in, like, the past decade, maybe decade and a half, that has actually made me want to eat Subway. It's always an extremely fucking, like... It's always this thing where it's like, eat Subway, uh, sports. Here's a sportsman to tell you to eat Subway, and it's like, I don't care about this football guy. This Is this football guy gonna make me my sandwich? Is he gonna come to my home and make me a sandwich with his football hands? He's not? Okay, then I don't give a fuck about him. Are you gonna make me a good sandwich? Are you gonna bring back the seafood sensation? Are, are, are you gonna bring back, you know, all the shit you got rid of? Are you gonna return your prices to reasonable goddamn prices and stop skimping on everything when I order? No? 
Then I don't give a fuck about football man telling me to, to eat this, this nasty meatball sub that he's never eaten in his entire life. How stupid do you think I am? You really think I'm gonna see this commercial and say, hmm, football man eats the subway sandwich, I'm gonna eat it now too. Okay, I'm ready, I'm ready to eat the subway sandwich because football man told me to. I'm gonna go over the subway. Cause football Gary told me to go get the meatball sandwich from the local subway and I gotta do it. He won the Super Ring 12 years in a row and he only beat his wife one time. So he's my hero. <laughs> Did you know that football players can't even use their rings to summon Captain Planet? They can't use it to cast healing magic. They can't use them to decode messages. They just sit there. They just sit here and do nothing. They're worthless. They're absolutely worthless. In fact, hold on, let me check something here. No. Okay, football ring does nothing. Whereas if I go on Amazon right now, and I look for decoder ring. Okay. Here we go. With a low price of like, For the low, low price of um, eleven fifty, you can buy a decoder ring, which will let you decode messages from all your friends and and and, and send secret messages to your to to your, your your best buddies. And you don't even have to win a Super Bowl to do to get it. You don't. You don't have to. So I don't know about you, but I'm gonna go to Subway wearing my decoder ring, and I'm gonna stick my hand... I'm gonna stick my hand into the, the tub of, of... of... of the vegetarian patties... that have been sitting in that tub for three months, because who the fuck eats the vegetarian sandwich at Subway? And then I'm gonna leave. I'm gonna fucking leave. What do you think's in that Subway Vegetarian Patty? I, I dropped my star. I'm back. Because when you look at the, the Subway Veggie Patty, it, it's got like... It's got bits and all sorts of colors. And it makes me wonder what's in there. What does it taste like? Because I've never tried it, and I promise you I never will, because just thinking about them sitting in that little tub for like six months on end because the franchise owner doesn't want to spend any money to buy more... ...has completely put me off to them. Luigi eats the veggie sandwiches at Subway. You know what was a veggie product I liked when I was younger? Boca Burgers. They kind of had a similar appearance to the Subway veggie sandwich. And you know, I didn't get them. I didn't eat them because of vegetarian. I got them because they were alright. I didn't pretend they were burgers. They tasted nothing like burgers. But they were okay. Why does the Subway Veggie Patty have eggs and milk in it? Because they were invented at a time where vegetarianism was a fad and vegan wasn't really a thing that was popular yet, so there was no reason to make stuff without milk and cheese and eggs and shit. Like, veganism didn't come popular until, like, I want to say in the early 2000s, maybe? I could be completely wrong, I could be talking out of my own butthole.
didn't get all the stars, so it doesn't matter. We got Luigi. Gamers, I need this. I'm so surprised that for the majority of this stream, the baby has basically more or less stayed quiet, only kind of crying once or twice. Like she's still here. She's still here, just snoozing in my arms. You know? Uh-oh. 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 Wait, wait, maybe she'll go back to sleep. Maybe she'll sleep. Okay, she stopped. Take oh. Oh. oh, you're good. Don't worry. Go back to sleep. No, it's fine. Go back to sleep. Go back to sleep. I think we're okay. I think we're okay. We're okay. So, cross the bridge, go up, go this way. This reminds me of some of our click and play levels. Alright, let's see where we go. Uh oh! Uh oh! Uh oh! Okay, okay, it's fine. She passed out again. We're good. It's okay. It's okay. I, 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 I oh, oh, she, oh, okay. She, she's moving a little. Uh oh. Uh oh. Gamers. 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 Are you done? Finished? Quite done? Okay. She just farted. Again. Are you done screaming? Are you done screaming? Have you finished your screaming? Okay, she might be okay. She might be okay. Oops, hold on. Let's see. This time we got it. Oh, Mario! Alright, oh, here we go. Oh god, I forgot those are timer blocks. I don't know why I forgot that. The whole gimmick of this stage, is, this world is timer blocks. <sighs> Mario. Why is the baby farting all the time? This is like, this, this, you know. Gamer. Got running out of gamer time. Come on. Oh, Luigi, save me. Oh, no. Okay, let's see. Uh, why the little blocks? The little blocks are just annoying.
Oh no. Boing, boing, boing. Fuck it, let's just send him to Luigi. Wait, no, that's not Luigi. Oh no, gamers. Every time Mario lands and busts his knees, I just imagine the OOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOOO
Mario, you stink. You know what? I think Mario is dumb. And I think he deserves to have his head stuck in that barrel. That's what I think. I think he deserves it. Just let him... Just let it happen, Mario. Just let it happen. You deserve it, Mario. Because we're worth it, too. Because we're worth it, too. Mario is very smelly. Oh my god! Oh! Oh! Ooh, ow! Oh, my back is all messed up from holding this bab. I'm holding this babarino. I'm holding this little babushk. Oh! Look at her. Look at how dumb she is. Look at how incredibly dumb she is. He doesn't even know anything. He doesn't even know anything. What am I supposed to do with this? What am I supposed to do with this? I don't know. Mr. Rock. Crab apples, thanks for donating. Oh, Lord. Oh, oh, oh she's flailing her arms. She's flailing. Her eyes are open. She looked at me. Oh, oh, she's falling asleep again. <laughs> I don't know what's wrong with her. Why do you like this? Why do you do these things? What's wrong with you? Gamer, she's looking at the chat with disgust right now. With much disgust. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, well... That was our stream... for the day. What? What do you want? Tell me. I don't, I don't think she knows if she wants to wake up or not. Um, that was our stream for the day. She just farted. Um, so we're going to see how Friday streams are going to work. I might have to move Friday streams to Thursday. And then we'll do Tuesday stream, Thursday stream, and Saturday stream instead of Tuesday, Friday, and, and Saturday. So keep that in mind. I'll talk about it again on Tuesday. But I'm thinking right now we might have to move the Friday stream to Thursday. That might just be what has to happen for now. So, I'll think about it. I'll consider it. And I'll figure out what's going on. I'll figure it out. Why are you hitting me? Why would you hit me? Don't hit me. Where are you going? Where are you going? I don't know what to do with her. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Can't believe she would hit me. I can't believe she would hit me. Gamers! Look at her. That's all I have to say. Just look at her. What am I supposed to do with this? What am I supposed to do with this? All right, I need to turn this stream off before I sit here just wiggling the baby in front of the camera for three hours. Okay, let me, let me put the baby back down here. Uh-oh. Gamers, I think she might be trying to make a star field in her pants. Um, okay, let me let me turn the stream off. I need to stop this. Thanks for watching. Thanks for tuning in. The, tune in tomorrow, probably at 1 p.m. Eastern, when we're going to try to do some more work on the click-and-play game. 
I should probably. Uh oh. Oh no, I should probably go. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Uh-oh! Oh, she likes it. She likes this. She prefers this. Okay, let me stop. Let me seriously stop. If I don't stop now, I'm never gonna stop. Okay. I'm turning it off. I'm turning it off. Ah! Ah!